Hello everyone, it's Judy and you welcome to Smartboard Series. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up ECG and blood pressure measurement on your Galaxy Watch 5 or Galaxy Watch 5 Pro the proper way. Like the Galaxy Watch 4 and Galaxy Watch 4 Classic, the Galaxy Watch 5 and Galaxy Watch 5 Pro also feature ECG and blood pressure measurement. Now for you to have access to these features, you need to set these features up. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do just that now if you don't have ecg and blood pressure measurement on your glass 5 or glass 5 pro due to contrary restriction there is a video on how to get these features on your Galaxy watch check the description to do just that please note that you should never take any medications based on the readings you get from your Galaxy watch 5 or Galaxy watch 5 pro without first taking the approval of a qualified healthcare professional. To set up ECG and blood pressure measurement, we need the Samsung Health Monitor app. We are going to start with blood pressure and to set up blood pressure, we need to calibrate the Galaxy Watch 5 Pro here. Now this calibration process is so important and from my little research, the best time to check your blood pressure is right after you wake up in the morning and before going to bed. Now I'm about to go to bed, I'm going to calibrate Galaxy Watch 5 Pro here and when I wake up in the morning, I will calibrate it again to be sure that I have the best accurate measurement. So guys, to calibrate the blood pressure measurement, I will simply go to the blood pressure app here. Now this is the blood pressure app. I'm so tap on learn more on this, it says open, open phone app. And this will open the Samsung Health Monitor app. Okay, so go to phone and accept the terms and condition. And grant permission for Samsung Health Monitor to access Samsung Health. Okay. Let's have one done. Now you need to fill in your details here to create your profile. Once you are done filling in your details, tap on continue. And it says for the world to measure blood pressure, you must first calibrate it with a cough based blood pressure monitor, which is what I have here. And tap on calibrate. Okay, it says you will need a valid blood pressure monitor. You will follow instructions within the phone app to take three measurements and you will need to wear your watch during this time. So tap on next to proceed and to ensure more accurate measurements, calibrate. Okay, we're gonna tap on next. So go through each of these um, warnings, okay? And once you're done with that, tap on get started. So guys, go ahead and wear your Galaxy Watch 5 Pro. Now this shouldn't be too tight, okay? And you need to give a little space. So once you've done that, tap on next. Now you need to wear the cuff on the opposite side, okay? I'm wearing this on my left wrist. All right, guys, I have just worn the cuff. I'm going to tap on next to proceed. Now I need to start the blood pressure monitor. So go ahead and start your blood pressure monitor. Okay, here we go. We have the first measurement. Now tap on yes, enter now. And we have the systolic as 121 and diastolic is 71. I'm going to tap on done and I'm going to confirm this. Okay, now that is the first measurement. Okay, we need to take two more. Tap on next and tap on next here and start a blood pressure monitor again. So guys, we have the second reading and this one is 121 against 72 and 89 B per minute heart rate. So I'm going to enter 121, diastolic is 72 and I will tap on done and I'm going to confirm this and we need to go ahead and finish this with the last measurement. So tap on next and tap on next again Now start the blood pressure monitor.
So guys, we have the final reading. I'm going to enter that. Okay, enter now. One, two, three, and that's to link is 74. Tap on done and confirm this. So it says calibration finish. I'm going to tap on okay to finish this. So let's see how this goes. Okay, I'm going to measure my blood pressure here and I'll compare it with that of the Galaxy 5 Pro. Okay. We have one to five and 72. I'm going to go here. I'll tap on OK and I'll measure my blood pressure here. Tap on OK again. So you can see the results we have on the Galaxy 5 Pro compared to the arm run blood pressure monitor here is almost the same. Again, I will recommend that to get the best possible results, you need to calibrate the Galaxy 5 first thing in the morning and before you go to bed. To set up ECG, I'm going to locate the ECG app, okay? Okay, locate the ECG app on your Galaxy 5 or Watch 5 Pro and tap on learn more and it says um, open app okay open phone app and this will open the ecg app on the samsung health monitor okay now tap on get started and tap on next it says um how the ecg app works okay tap on next and you have um, all of this here it says you may see one of these um, results and all of this go through them and tap on next and you should know, okay, this is our warnings, okay, go through them and tap on next. And you have other warnings again, go through them and tap on next. Okay, now it says the wrist orientation is set to left. Okay, this is what I selected when I set up the Galaxy with 5 Pro here. You can always change this by going to watch settings, general orientation, and then choose your wrist orientation. So go ahead and tap on next to proceed. And there we go. And there we go. ECG is now ready to be taken on the Galaxy Note 5 Pro. Tap on done. Okay. I'm going to test this out. I'll go to the ECG app. Okay. And I'll tap on this. And I'll tap on OK. And I'll place my finger here. So guys, you can see how ECG works on the Galaxy Watch 5 Pro. So that is how you can set up ECG and blood pressure measurement the accurate way, the proper way on your Galaxy Watch 5 or Galaxy Watch 5 Pro. And that is it for this video. Please, if you find this video helpful, give me a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, click on the subscribe button and do not forget to turn on the notification bell to always get updates from me whenever I upload a video like this. Until next time guys, goodbye.